Starting March 1st, Minnesota will begin offering licensed cannabis sales across the state. And right now, Olmstead County is updating its rules for cannabis businesses to provide more clarity on procedures before that day arrives. KTDC's Matt Rainier is with us here in studio tonight after speaking with a county public health official. So, Matt. What are we seeing here as far as changes go? Yeah, Brock Kalen, Olmstead County is making amendments to its cannabis ordinances in a few different areas. This includes cannabis business registration, rules for cannabis events, age compliance checks, and penalties for not following these regulations. Now, any businesses that want to operate as a cannabis retail business must register with the county before opening. It also must pass a review process. Anyone that's looking to host a temporary cannabis event will need to get a permit from the county. In addition to following several guidelines for this kind of an event, this includes things like ID checks. In order to ensure a business is not selling cannabis to someone who is underage, each year there will be an unannounced compliance check for those businesses and for not registering a business, there will be a $2,000 violation. I asked a county official why these measures are being put in place now. Here's what he had to say. So we were working through this process because there is also like an early applicant uh, pool for at the state level um, that are kind of going through an equity evaluation. So there's the, there was the thought that early applicants might come in as soon as the start of the year potentially. And if cannabis is sold to anyone who is underage, that business may be facing fines or have its registration suspended for 30 days. Olmstead County says these ordinances officially go into effect on November 23rd. Live here in the studio, Matt Rainier, KTDC News.